Line 22, 7B247, Planck, space time, atoms, quantum fields, Big Bang, Wow SETI. There's the alien radio signal. And this down a bit. So you get it in there. There we go. Big Bang diagram, dark matter particles, Planck, space time, atoms, quantum field, the keyword research line 22 well data. So keyword to Google was quantum fluctuations, February 25th, 2014. Quotes and diagrams are from a blog. Um, we're just doing research right now about quantum fluctuations and we'll be doing the formulas after I find out what it's, all, everything about it. Another way of seeing this problem is trying to reproduce the Greek philosophers thinking about matter as applied to space-time. For example, if we continue to divide for matter, sorry, if we continue to divide matter, we get to atoms, try to divide atoms and you get quantum fields. What does a space-time look like at the quantum level? Probably a quantum chaos. You see these squiggly lines on top here and that shows it breaking it down. Events before this Planck time are undefined at in our current science, and in particular, we have no solid understanding of the origin of the universe, i.e. what started or caused the Big Bang, although we are working on that. At best, we can describe our efforts to date as probing around the edges of our understanding in order to define what we don't understand. Much like a blind person would explore the edge of a deep hole, learning its diameter without knowing its depth. So here's a diagram here. I don't know if you can see it. It says temperature in degrees K on the side here, 10 to the 34. And then it shows, I'll go down the words one by one. This is space-time foam, quarks, leptons, created inflation. Four forces established leptons, split into neutrinos, electrons. Gravity governs expansion. Quarks make protons, neutrons, and the neutri neutrinos decouple. And then it shows electrons and positrons annihilate. annihilate leaving a small number of unmatched electrons. Then the fusion of H and HE, photons decouple equals CMB, and then out galaxy stars, planets form, to 13 billion years. Um, this says 76% hydrogen, 24% helium in this time period, 1 million, one second, I guess. And this shows new protons and neutrons, electrons, quarks, electrons, positrons, neutrinos, antineutrinos, photons, gravitons, leptons, and then black holes. So that's the old age of the universe diagram there. I found it was interesting. So it's from this link, abyss, A-B-Y-S-S dot U-O-R-E-G-O-N dot E-D-U. And the data will continue in the next video. Thanks for watching.